hello i welcome you to this video in this video i'll be showing you how to create this groove on the wall and you can see this is we cannot use wall sweep in this case because this is just vertical it's not going around the wall it just is like a patch and has the grooves on it so to be able to create this kind of groove we'll be using model in place and i will show you exactly how you can do that now right now we are in revit so what i'm going to do is to go to the approach view i'll go to approach view select model in place i use shortcuts if you want to use shortcuts you can use shortcuts and if you don't want to use shortcuts simply click on this uh, component on the architecture tab click on component and click on model in place and select any of these i would like to select casework and click ok click ok again and simply draw a rectangle simply draw a rectangle and click on this to pick this plane this is the plane we want to draw on and select a rectangle and here we go i like to align it to this wall and the height should be something like 950 950 mm and click and i can remove this dimension then i am going to place a, um, a reference plane i will place a reference plane here rp for reference plane and use dimension and make sure that the the depth of the groove is 50 that is the essence of the reference plane okay now i can now copy this and place it on top of the reference plane and i can multiply this now i'm going to select multiple and i will pick this as my base point so that the distance between each of the groove will be 50 mm and that way it will be faster for me within few minutes i will be done creating this and i will give the material change the material to something else if i like i can pick let me look for material that can that will look good for me let me go towards the default i'll use the default wall okay let me use default wall let me name it as groove materials groove materials and click ok and finish it at this level ok the depth should be 50 mm and click apply 
Now let's finish it and see. Okay, if you look at it now, it is actually a groove, but let's check our our case study. Let's check our case study and look at okay. It is actually starting from the ground. Starting from the ground to the concrete face here. Okay, let's go back to our work. Okay, this is it. So I will edit it further. I will edit again and go to the approach view and move all this one to the ground. Okay, then I cannot copy this one. Just copy and paste like that. And it's already touching the concrete face here, which is what we want. Finish it. Now you can see that it is covering the window, and we don't want it to cover the window. So we want to open it. We want to open where the window is. The simple tool we use is um, void extrusion. So while we are still in the editing mode, you can see we are in editing mode if it is like this. Okay, we are going to select create, then select void, void extrusion, and we are to select the work plane now. Click and pick this work plane and make sure this select element by face is on so that you'll be able to select the face and now i will pick a rectangle just to draw the outline of the window is the outline of the window and finish it then click on this cut so that it will be able to cut the model to cut the the extrusion and finish it let's look at it in 3d now you can see that is it here that is the groove is perfect okay so that is how you create groove using model in place and i hope you benefit something from this video if you do don't forget to give me a video testimonial and let me know your comments in the comment section all right see you in the next video bye